My name is Andy Ingram, Mayor of Sherrall, South Carolina. I want to thank you for tuning in to the South Carolina Jazz Festival Virtual Edition as we celebrate the legacy of native son, Dizzy Gillespie. Our lineup this year includes regional, national, and international musicians as we celebrate Dizzy's 103rd birthday. This is our 14th year honoring his contribution to jazz, and we hope to see you for the 15th Jazz Festival here in Sherrall in 2021. I'm Lindsay Bennett with the Sherrall Arts Commission. On behalf of the town of Sherrall, South Carolina, and the South Carolina Jazz Festival, I would like to thank Winyah Auditorium in Georgetown, South Carolina, for hosting today's concert featuring the Cousins Group. Since 2006, the town of Sherrall and the South Carolina Jazz Festival have remembered South Carolina's native son, Dizzy Gillespie, and his jazz legacy. Every October, the South Carolina Jazz Festival celebrates Dizzy's birthday and his contribution to jazz. We invite you to join us October 2021 for the South Carolina Jazz Festival in Sherrall. Hello, this is John Long with First Bank, and on behalf of the First Bank family, we are once again proud sponsors of the 2020 Jazz Festival. You know, we've been sponsoring the Chiral Jazz Festival for the past 14 years, and especially during this time of COVID and social distancing, 
we think it's so important to do something to relax, have fun, and I can't think of a better way than the arts. So once again, sit back, relax, and on behalf of First Bank, enjoy the Jazz Festival. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to our quarantine concert series. My name is Stephen Locken Feifke. I'm Alexa Quarantino. And before we get things started tonight, we just want to say a huge thank you to everybody who has been with us for the past few months uh, since mid March. This is our 25th quarantine concert, and we are thrilled to be dedicating tonight's performance to the one and only Charlie Parker, who was a huge influence on both Alexa and myself in developing our interest and our love of jazz music. Um, Charlie Parker was just the most phenomenal alto saxophonist and truly was one of the pioneers of bebop, which is what uh, a lot of the music that Alexa and I play stems out of. Uh, so we're going to be paying tribute to Bird tonight. And actually, this concert will be our last concert before October. We are going to be taking the month of September off. Um, and so this is going to be an extra extra special one for, for everybody, which is why we're at this piano. This piano is almost as old as, or actually even older than Charlie Parker would have been today. So we thought that that would be a nice touch. Um, if you're just joining us for the first time on Facebook or YouTube or on Crowdcast, we want to welcome you to our series and, and urge you to please <laughs> come back in October when we're back um, and let you know that the one of the biggest parts of this concert series has been that we have been donating 25% of all of our proceeds to organizations that 
we believe make the world a better place. We've donated over $10,000 um, to organizations supporting the Black Lives Matter movement, uh, to COVID-19 musician relief funds, and this month we are donating 25% of all of our proceeds towards the New York City jazz venues that we call home, and hopefully they'll still be around when this is all, this pandemic is all said and done. So without further ado, uh, I'm going to pass the mic on to Alexa, who's going to say a few words as well. And thanks again, everybody, for tuning in. Welcome back, everybody. Happy Sunday. We also want to send a huge shout out to Rockport Music, who is cross-posting our live stream tonight. And Rockport Music is based in Rockport, Mass., um, just north of Boston. And so we were very excited to be able to collaborate with them to bring this concert uh, to people all across the internet, especially because we were in the Boston Globe last week as their critics pick for the weekend. So we're keeping the Boston uh, momentum going and um, very excited to welcome any Rockport music viewers who have not been with us before. So as a friendly reminder, 25% of all the proceeds will go to the NYC venues. And if you are watching on Facebook, you can donate by clicking the Crowdcast link that's in the caption. Um, and if you're on Crowdcast, you can donate by clicking the button that says donate on the bottom uh, corner of your screen. So we're gonna start out tonight with a tune of birds. Uh, that's Charlie Parker's nickname. Um, we're gonna start with Scrapple from the Apple. And this is a big shout out to Heidi and Mitch Tyson who were silver sponsors from last week who were kind enough to be rollover sponsors because we just had an amazing uh, response last week and we couldn't give everybody their own song. So um, Heidi and Mitch, we appreciate appreciate your support so much. This is for you.
Awesome. Uh, well, thanks so much, uh, Heidi and Mitch, for uh, being sponsors for that last song. And I don't know if you're tuning in, but maybe you can hear us from across the road uh, in Lexington. Uh, we're going to just keep things moving right along. There's nothing better than playing Charlie Parker's music. Uh, if you tuned in late, thanks so much for joining us, whether you're on Facebook, YouTube, or on Crowdcast. 25% um, of all the proceeds for tonight's concert are going towards the New York City jazz venue venues that we call home. So we're going to continue now. This is a blues that Charlie Parker wrote. And this is uh, one of Alexa's favorites, as I understand it. And this one is called Cheryl. Uh, thanks so much to Carol Sims for being uh, another rollover sponsor from last week's performance. Um, we really appreciate you, and we hope you enjoy this performance of Cheryl.
All right, everybody, that was Cheryl for one of last week's Silver Sponsors, Carol Sims. Thank you so much, Carol. We're getting some awesome comments, and um, one of my favorite things is reading everybody's comments and thoughts, so thank you all for being with us, and I'm so glad these earrings, Rob, I got some new ones in here today. If anybody has been with us since the beginning, you know that one of my things is I like to switch out my earrings, so that's the extra perk of tuning in live every week. Um and again, we want to thank uh, Rockport Music for, for cross-posting us this week. So again, if you're new and just joining us, we are um, with Rockport Music cross-posting. We are in, in the Massachusetts area, and we were thrilled to be a Boston Globe Critics pick last week. So we're keeping that Boston love going. And you can donate to our favorite uh, jazz venues that we call home. Again, we've been giving 25% of proceeds, and so the donate button is on Crowdcast uh, there for you. Or if you are on Facebook, please consider clicking that Crowdcast link and following us on Crowdcast so that you can stay tuned about our upcoming events. Um, as Stephen mentioned, September has turned out to be quite crazy. Um, we're actually both uh, have we have, have some new music in store for all of you. We each have some of our new music and new records that we're putting together in September and that combined with holidays and family and all this stuff it's just there's a lot happening so we're going to do some things on Sunday try to do some watch parties and things of, of archived concerts perhaps but we will be taking um, September off of live concerts so up next we've got a great tune not written by Charlie Parker but often performed by him and one of my favorite versions of this um, is Charlie Parker with strings which is one of my absolute favorite records of all time and so this is Just Friends and we'd like to dedicate this to Alfred Schweisgut, who is a new uh, a new friend of ours, and I hope that you're able to tune in live, Alfred. Thank you so much for your gold sponsorship, and I think I saw you. I, you might be live with us because I think we saw your your comment. Um, we just we so appreciate your generosity and your support, and welcome to our online Crowdcast family. So this is for you, Alfred. This is just friends.
Awesome. And our live in studio audience is here. Hello. Thank you so much for being here. They're they're being uh, uh, subdued tonight. I don't know, <laughs> but we're glad to have them here, obviously. And thanks for letting us play here. So uh, before we go on, we do have a couple of questions or a couple of comments. Um, Kevin Hogue says, Lush Life. Wow. Either Ella or Johnny Hartman. Uh, did it hit you like it hit me? That is a soul shaker. Um, yes, that yeah. is probably the most beautiful version of that song there is. Um, we're actually about to play a different ballad. <laughs> but <laughs> but for October, I mean, maybe we should do a night like dedicated to Johnny Hartman. Or like the music, of, like maybe that the music off that record. We'll, we'll have to talk about it and see. Um, and then uh, Mike Sane says, amazing as always. Thanks, Mike. For those of us who don't know, how did you two come to play together and for how long? Um, Thanks, Mike. Thanks so much for joining us. It's been great to see your name on the attendee list every week. Um, we, Stephen and I actually, we met in at a high school summer camp at Skidmore Jazz Institute um, with one of our teachers who has been so incredibly supportive and, and generous over the years, and that's Mr. Zaffitz, who is watching as well. Um, and yeah, so then we reconnected when I moved to New York and he had been in New York for a while and uh, he, Steven has a big band and so I started playing with his big band and then he kind of started playing with my quartet and teaching at my summer jazz program, Rockport Jazz Workshop, um, which is a collaboration between Rockport Music and Rockport Public Schools. So that's how the uh, collaboration with Rockport Music Tonight came to be. And yeah, and so um, he was on, Steven was on my recent quartet record called clarity and um he has an upcoming big band record that i'm also on so um and we also <laughs> live together <laughs> and are together so that's how this all came to be we've been <laughs> stuck together through quarantine loving every second of it um yeah definitely gave us a, a unique opportunity to be able to create music together throughout this time which um, we were able to do safely which is a huge plus so anyway, thanks for those questions. Back to our scheduled programming. We're going to continue now with a beautiful ballad. Uh, this one is dedicated to the Nancaro family. Thank you so much for all of your support over the past few months. This one is Body and Soul. Thank you. 
Thank you. Thank you. Um, wow. It's so great to see so many familiar and new names um, in our Crowdcast comments. So thank you all and welcome so much. Um, we have an international crowd tonight, which is just so awesome. And we love seeing the camaraderie between everybody. And um, Kevin, we definitely want to hear more about how Kevin mentioned he knows Bird's niece, which is pretty incredible. Um, so just amazing and again if you're new or you're just joining us um please on facebook please head over to our crowdcast page you'll see our crowdcast uh, link in there and you can catch 23 of our archived concerts that are still in our crowdcast library we have things um from a master class with winton marsalis to pre-concert conversations all of the above we've got it all in there and so while we are going to be on hiatus for the next four weeks we do hope that you'll join us in october please 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 come back um we're going to miss you so much and um, we're sorry that we're not going to be able to make our usual time live, but we promise we will have some fun things up our sleeves and have some things uh, going on through September for you. So um, we're going to move on now with a tune uh, for our gold sponsor, Kevin Hogue, who we love very much. And he mentioned a little something about this in the comments and we were able to catch it just before we started. So Kevin, this is Donna Lee just for you. Thank you so much for your support and hope you enjoy. Thank you. 
I love playing on that tune. We'll have to we'll have to make a a, a duo recording at some point of all of these. Yes. Uh, yeah, I don't know if if you had a, if you're tuning in and you've been tuning in from the beginning, especially, and you have a favorite song that Alexa and I played, please consider writing it to us in the comments, either on Crowdcast or on Facebook or on YouTube, because that idea actually sounds kind of kind of cool. Like if we made a duo recording of of these and maybe we could you know because we're taking the month of september off maybe we can even do like a little quarantine standards duo album during september so raise your virtual hand if that's exciting my dad's here he raised his physical hand <laughs> yeah sorry we can't see your virtual hand <laughs> your physical hand is fine <laughs> but yeah we seriously I, I that that sounds like an exciting thing that we could do um all right well yeah, apparently. Hey, that's uh, that's okay. <laughs> so just in case you're tuning in periodically on Facebook, thank you so much for joining us. Um, we know that the stream is different than it works on Crowdcast. 25% of proceeds from tonight's concert is going towards the New York City jazz venue venues that we call home. Basically, the places in New York City that we play, that we developed our craft at, that um, book us for concerts during normal circumstances, and yeah. So anyway, we're going to continue with music, but we really appreciate you, you tuning in and joining us tonight. From wherever you are in the world, we have people here from Australia even. Um, what and, and, and Brazil, 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 okay. and um, did I say Brazil enough times? Applause. Brazil and um, Austria. Do we have Japan here as well? Oh my gosh, this is incredible. So, you guys are it so this has just been an awesome opportunity for for Alex and I to connect with so many people from around the world. And we just want you to know that even though we're taking the month of September off, we do have exciting things in store, and we look forward to playing live concerts for you again starting on October fourth. So we're gonna oh, uh, Rob Horton's. Uh, okay, we have a lot of thumbs up actually. It's happening. Tell them it's happening. It's happening. It's happening. It's happening. It's happening. And uh, Rob Horton says, uh, and hello from Mexico. Rob Horton st says, still crazy after all these years. That's a and Claudia says, hello from Mexico. Hi, I mean, this is just so awesome. I mean, that's one of the blessings in disguise of quarantine is that we've been able to connect with all of you from, from afar. And uh, in many ways, it's actually brought us closer together. But the point of tonight's concert is to play a concert. So we're gonna get back to the music. Uh, this is one of my personal favorites. Um, it's a contrafact on a song called How High the Moon. And this is, a, a, a contrafact is when you take the same chord changes as a pre-existing song, in this case, How High the Moon, and then you write a new melody on top of it. So Charlie Parker actually did this quite a bit. And the last song we played, Donna Lee, was a contrafact on Back Home in Indiana. So this ornithology is a, uh, is a contrafact on how high the moon and ornithology i guess seems like it might be a bit of an inside joke for bird lovers because charlie parker's nickname as we said earlier in the stream was bird and ornithology obviously is the studies of bird Zzz, birds nice. so uh this one is a uh, awesome this one is dedicated to ken and diane solomon thank you so much for your frequent flyer mile <laughs> participation in this concert series, our quarantine concert series. All right, here we go, Ornithology.
Excellent. Well, please continue to send in your favorite songs from the Stephen Locke and Fife Gee and Alexa Quarantino songbook over the past 25 weeks. I think we have some takers for this duo record. So we're going to we're going to have to figure that out once we make we both have our own records happening in September. So we will we will make this happen somehow, some way or another. Um, 
And once again, thank you to Rockport Music for cross posting. I also want to just give a special shout out to um, our bronze sponsors. And we also had a fabulous platinum sponsor from last week that I think um, we mentioned we were kind of yes so we had a fabulous platinum sponsor gold silver bronze whatever you are whoever you are wherever you are we love you and we think you're awesome so thank you so much for your support um let's see what do we have here we're going to move on with anthropology another ology study of people isn't it anthropology is like the study of like culture like human culture I remember taking that class in high school, um, clearly a little rusty. So anyway, this is um, for Silver Sponsors, Dwayne and Ida Miller. Thank you so much. We love you so much. And this is Bird's Anthropology, another rhythm changes, which we love. A rhythm changes, which we love. Thank <laughs> you. 
Well, thanks to our live in studio audience for that enthusiastic <laughs> round of applause. <laughs> Um, and also for some snaps during. Sorry if I <laughs> got a little distracted. <coughs> and uh, and to Kevin, um, the uh, I am the right hand man. Left is getting it on too. I love your comments. We need to get you to write these duo record liner notes. <laughs> um, all right. Well, we're gonna keep things moving right along here. Um, and but before we do, I just want to say from both Alexa and I, we want to give a huge shout out to our Quarantino assistant. She's there in the chats, literally all of them, YouTube, Facebook, and uh, well, both both. So also on my YouTube, on Alexa's YouTube, on a step ahead Facebook, on Rockport Music Facebook, Jazz Workshop, Jazz Workshop and Shaylin Liu, right? Okay, and then uh, and then my Facebook page and Alexa. So it's a lot and. And uh, her name is not just Quarantino Assistant, it's also Mora. So Mora, thanks so much uh, for the past couple of months. We're looking forward to picking things back up in October. And um, <coughs> yeah, with that having been said, we're going to continue on now to our next selection, which is a personal favorite of mine. Um, one of my earliest Charlie Parker songs that I learned. I think it's uh, one of the first songs that many jazz students learn. So uh, fitting that we would be dedicating it to one of our former professors, the aforementioned uh, Gerald Zaffitz and the Zaffitz family. Thanks so much, uh, and uh, we hope you enjoyed this rendition of Confirmation. And Instagram. Thank you. 
All right. That's confirmation, a.k.a. You need confirmation that you know the changes because sometimes all the bird tunes can just flow together and sometimes I just play, you know, I'll mix up the bird bridges here and I'll just let it fly, just roll with it. Um, So that's what happened. That's great. And thank you, Kevin. That's so sweet of you. I appreciate you saying that. Honestly, all of you, um, this have just meant so much to me uh, and all of us, but but as a... uh, musician that has to put their instrument on their face um it's very easy for my muscles to go out of shape and in quarantine you know not having a gig every night it's it's not as bad as being a trumpet player or a trombone player where you you really 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 need to have the horn on your face for many many hours a day um but even just having these weekly gigs has just been a godsend because sometimes the weeks and the months just fly you know so um we really appreciate getting to perform for people who are there there every week um we are nearing the end of our of our set list here, we're going to move on with a tune for uh, for Emily, uh, one of our fabulous gold sponsors. This is My Little Suede Shoes. Emily, we love you very much. We appreciate you. Thank you so much. Um, and again, if you're just joining us, just tuning in, uh, we are happy to be cross-posting with Rockport Music tonight. Thank you to the Boston Globe for naming us a critic's pick last week. We're keeping that Boston love rolling. And if you're joining us on Facebook or YouTube, please uh, join us on Crowdcast. Click that Crowdcast link and make sure you follow us so that you are up to date when we come back ripping and roaring in October. Um, And if you are so inclined, you can click that donate button and 25% of proceeds go to our New York jazz venues that we call home. This is my little suede shoes. Thank you. 
Thanks, Gary. Yes, I totally agree. And in fact, I'd I'd actually uh, I'd, I'd actually not not I, I I shouldn't stand to correct you. I don't even have a shoe to stand on. But what we're really after here is an LL Bean sponsorship. We've been trying to get that since the middle of March. So if anybody who's tuning in now that we're on all these platforms, if you know someone at LL Bean, like we're not joking. This <laughs> we really <laughs> want an LL Bean endorsement. Um, I especially need help. Um, wow, I can't believe I just showed my uh, feet on on a uh, on Instagram <laughs> on on all these platforms. Anyway, um, this has just been such a fun concert. Uh, we want to say a huge thank you to everybody who's tuned in tonight and also who's tuned in over the last three months. As Alexa mentioned, we're going to be going into the studio each of us separately and recording some new music, as well as now. Uh, <laughs> we've decided <laughs> that we're going to be recording a quarantine standards record. So uh, there's a lot to look forward to, even though there's a, there's a bit of a break and we'll definitely be um, keeping up to date with everybody with some neat surprises over the month that are just unique to those of you who have signed up through our Crowdcast page. So if you're enjoying what you're hearing on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, uh, please do consider clicking that link, crowdcast.io slash Stephen and Alexa, and give us a follow. That way we can stay in touch with you throughout the month, the, the month of September. Um, because who knows how long this is going to last, you know? Uh, we, um, and we just want to be able to connect with all of you that we can. So um, again, happy 100th birthday to Bird and a huge thank you to Rockport Music uh, for partnering with us for this live stream event. Alexa's actually got a, um, a quartet gig there herself for part of their live streaming series and they are just putting on some amazing shows and doing um, some amazing work while we're all in quarantine. So if you head on over to their page, they'll definitely have a lot of information about that for you. Um, so... Yes, yeah, absolutely. Uh, so Alexa's got a, a little bit more to say before we kick this off <laughs> right now. Yeah, famous feet, David. Um, hardly, <laughs> but uh, before we, <laughs> before my brother's there laughing at me uh, for my feet. <laughs> but anyway, before we close the concert out tonight, um, Alexa does want to say a few things. And thank you again so much to everybody who's tuned in tonight and who supported us for the past three months. And we just want to say a special thank you as well. Um, you know, every week we dedicate a song on the set list to gold sponsors and silver sponsors, but our bronze sponsors mean so much to us and just everybody that has been able to contribute. Um, it's just been such a crazy time without gigs. And to be honest, you all have um, just been so helpful and, and helping us get through and, and helping others get through um, as we've been donating to those other causes. So we want to also thank Joan Fralick, Al Toland, Edward Howe, Gary Brown, Jeff Phillips, Jose Luis Vasquez, Ken Hayes. Um, you all are so special to us. And so please, everybody, make sure if you are watching and joining us for the first time, like Jeff Phillips, thank you so much for joining us from the Rockport Music page. Um, anyone tuning in on Facebook or YouTube, please make sure we get you on Crowdcast and that way we will be able to notify you um, for October 4th. So as Maura, our fabulous Quarantino assistant mentioned, please send us any suggestions, any ideas that you have. We'll be brainstorming for you through September. Keep in touch and we will see you in October. This is a classic that was requested actually on YouTube. This is Blues for Alice, and we are going to dedicate this to our two families, the Tarantinos and the Fife Geys, for their gold fabulous sponsorship. Gold and more. They are the platinum gold. They are like onyx level, like the Del Delta 360 level. We love them. Hotel, yeah, the hotel level. Okay, we love you.
folks that is all from us for the summer months we'll be back uh in october on october 4th we really hope that we'll see you there until then my name is Stephen Locke and Feifke I'm Alexa Quarantino and uh see you in october. this is kind of sad we'll see you in october thanks everybody <laughs> <laughs>